unlike some most people here, we already know we won. So we do. we're having we're already having a good time. Okay, great. <laughs> Congratulations. Um, what does that mean to you? You know, receiving that. I think for us and for Glad, obviously, it's all about representation and what that has done. I mean, without representation, we wouldn't see the policies move in this country. And so, you know, Wilson was the first out gay actor. So to celebrate this this moment, he was on the Glad board and he was a, worked at Glad. So um, 30 year relationship, 30. the longest relationship I've ever had <laughs> is with Glad. So we're excited, you know, when we started as an organization, there were zero series regular LGBTQ characters. Today, there's 600. And you know, this this organization was founded during the AIDS crisis because we needed people to understand us as a community. We're such ignorance about who we are, about our lives. And we understood, our founders understood that we needed to tell people about our lives. And once they understood us and saw us as human beings, they would support us. And we've seen that over and over again for 40 years about the power of storytelling. So that's what we're celebrating tonight. And tonight we're going to talk about how we need to see more trans characters because that's where we we know that people don't know uh, trans folks and the void is being filled with lies and misinformation and we need to humanize the trans community and build empathy and connection. One more question for you, Wilson. You have Star Trek Discovery final season coming up. What can viewers expect? What are you excited for them to see? Well, you know, we didn't know it was our final season when yeah. we were making it. But um, funny enough, it's such a huge story that, that we're taking part in in season five that it makes sense to go out on this story. It's, it's, uh, it, we, we go back to a little bit of Star Trek lore, I'll tell you that much. Um, I have some great stuff that I'm really excited for people to see. And, you know, it's been an honor to play this Puerto Rican gay man in the future. It's been um, really comforting to me to know that there that we are still, 2,000 years from now, there are still brown people, gay people like me, who are just trying to love and raise a family. Amazing. Thank you both so much. Congrats again.